Hey, that's enough. Don't come no closer. Don't come no closer. I'm asking you to step back. I'm asking you to step back. You don't tell me what to do in the public right here. Dude, just go, all right? You're in your house. I I was sent out here. Don't get in my face because you're making me feel threatened. Step back, please. I'm asking you to step back. Okay. Excuse I'll step back. I'll step. I don't got to go nowhere. I'm leaving without you. All right. Man, listen. If you, if you get come to me one more time, if you get one more close to me, I'm knocking you the f out. Oh, yeah. yeah. See? Come See? On. Oh, you want. <laughs> See, I, I wish you would have just left me alone. You didn't have to do that. I didn't punch you, dude. You punched me. I asked you to get back. I asked you to get back, didn't I? You were just here looking for didn't I? I'm here looking for trouble? Yeah, you are. Oh, okay. You're right. Yeah, I know I am. You're right. That's what I do. That's what black people do. Hope you feel better. <laughs> Listen, that was self defense. Consequences and repercussions. The man continued to say, Sir, please. Back away, you make me feel threatened here. I'm gonna back away. He backed away. Still, the white male continued to be aggressive, indicating violence as his intention. Put up his picture. Ugh. If consequences and repercussions had a face connected to it, it'd be this guy. Now, there's a part of me that feels bad for him. Very small, insignificant part of me. <laughs> All right, um, I do not condone violence. I say that, I submit that to you for the television audience. Um, this is something that we highlight as a public service announcement. Do not engage in this kind of activity. This is criminal behavior. When you decide to aggressively approach somebody, when you are putting them in proximity of your violence or intended violence, they have the right to defend themselves. That's exactly what happened. Here, Jeff thoughts. This is the worst case of a self fulfilling prophecy I've ever seen in my life. So the white guy, the Karen, man Karen, if you will, Kim, I forgot what they're called, walked over with the presumption that the black man was gonna do something dangerous, provoked the black man, and then he ended up doing something dangerous to him. Has he not seen the nutty professor? You, you walking over, but you limping back? Has he not seen life? You 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 try to come up here and get my cornbread. There's gonna be consequences and repercussions. Which, by the way, I'm sorry. The cinematography of this video was fantastic. The 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 cut and then the cut back and you see his face. I am just wondering what happened to this man. Like, did he turn into the Hulk and destroy this dude? Like, what happened in that time? Like, was it five seconds? Are we talking five minutes? How much did we miss? And then like. I don't condone, okay, I don't condone violence, okay? I don't. But I would pay per view to see that footage. Like, I would pay to see it. I would pay to see it. There has to be a camera somewhere yeah. that took footage of this that we need to see to show people to, like, hey, mind your business. Leave yeah. people alone. Well, we did not see uh, the attack, uh, and obviously, neither did he.